Hey everyone, I'm Navaz Modi Singhania of the Body Art Fitness Centers and today I wanted to discuss bulimia nervosa with you, also called bulimia, a common eating disorder which causes a person to binge eat large quantities of food at a go and then to purge it, self-induced purging, often done in secret. Watch out for classic telltale signs of bulimia. For instance, misuse of diuretics or diet pills, laxative packaging lying about the place, excessive compulsive exercising, hiding food or lying about food in order to binge and purge in private later, empty food wrappers lying about the place, dental issues because self-induced vomiting can erode tooth enamel due to the strong stomach acids, puffy cheeks or jawline, acid reflux, gastro problems like constipation, weakness, fainting, irregular monthly cycles, dehydration. People with bulimia usually are ideal in body size and weight, but they don't see it that way. They tend to judge themselves rather harshly and have low self-esteem issues closely connected to their body image. Bulimia seems to affect females more than males and usually crops up in adolescence or early adulthood, but really can emerge at any age. It can be hard to spot as people with the condition will often binge and purge in private. Other behavioral and emotional symptoms would include frequent and extended visits to the restroom, particularly after a meal, an unhealthy preoccupation with body size and shape, an unjustified paranoia of putting on weight, depression, anxiety, substance abuse, feeling out of control and powerless in personal matters, guilt and shame, which is associated with eating, shying away from friends and family, kind of keeping to oneself. So what really leads to bulimia? The exact causes are not known, but it could be a combination of genetic factors, mental health matters, learned behaviors, and the environment. So if you have a relative that has or had an eating disorder, you would be at higher risk of developing one. The pop culture, social media, print media, TV, movies, all this can put a lot of pressure on people to have a certain body shape and size. These influences can lead to self-inflicted or even an actual body shaming and stress can be a huge trigger. As bulimia can prevent your body from getting the nutrients that it requires, this can give rise to many medical complications, including, but not limited to, throat and stomach ulcers, dental problems, esophagus inflammation and tears, gut and stomach damage, electrolyte imbalance, abnormal heart rhythm or arrhythmias, heart failure, even the increased risk of suicide. Hmm. Watch out for part two of this series where we will discuss diagnosis, management, treatment, prevention, and more. Till then, catch you on the other side.